Welcome back to Tom's Life. Today's Sunday special is Bang Bang Cauliflower. So the ingredients you need is cauliflower. To make the sauce, you will need one onion, garlic, ginger, chilli, olive oil, two limes, salt and ground black pepper, chilli so sweet chilli, piri piri or any hot sauce and corn flour and you also need golden syrup and coriander to serve. So first step we're going to prep our ingredients to make our sauce. So you're going to start prepping your onion. So first step you're going to prep your onion. You're first going to chop your ends off. You want to flatten it so it's more easy to chop. Then you're going to chop the end off. Chop to how much onion you want to use. You just start off with half. You want to peel two layers of the skin. Like that. And then if you want a little bit more onion, you've got half here. I might add a little bit more in. Now you want to slice it, not all the way through. Just like that. And then you want to turn it around. And you just want to slice it. Into little pieces. You want nice little pieces like that. Now you're going to get your small mixing bowl. You place them in. And it's up to you how much small onion you want to use. I'm going to use another third of my other half. So next step you want to prep your ginger. You just first want to chop it in half. Put one to one side. And then you just want to finely slice it. And now what you want to do is you want to bring it all back together. And you just want to make little fine little pieces. And then just bring it back together and just give it one final chop. Be careful with your fingers. Once you've got it into nice little pieces, you're going to also place it in with your onions. And you'll do the same again with your other half. And we're making like a, a hot sauce to go with our cauliflower. So next step, you're going to prep your garlic. You first want to trim the ends. Just like that and now you want to peel all the skin off your garlic then we'll finally dice it just like that we'll do the same with our other garlic clove in a minute so next step you want to place your knife over your garlic press down well you first want to slice it one way, bring it all back together and we just want to do little pieces just like that and like I said before we're going to make a sauce for our bang bang cauliflower so you're going to place all your garlic in with your onion and ginger and then you'll do the same with your other garlic clove to give flavour to your sauce. So next step you're going to prep your chilli. You're first going to chop your end off. You first want to chop it down the middle. Put it to one side. Just like that. And then you just want to slice it. Always going to move your fingers out the way. Just like that when you've got nice little pieces. You're going to place it in the bowl. And then we'll do the same with our, our half of chilli. And then when you have prepped all your chilli. 
you must wash your hands because you don't want when you have touched chilies you don't want to put them near your face because they could sting so you want to finally chop them like that then wash your hands and then you'll be okay so next step you want to next step you want to prep your coriander you got a bag of coriander and you want to take the leaves off the stalks so you're just picking all the stalk leaves off the stalks you can use the stalks for another recipe will give flavor but we just want the leaves and then you'll finally shred them this will just be for your presentation at the end it's up to you how much coriander you want to use but you just want to finally shred it in a minute once you have picked it up all the leaves all the stalks now once you have picked all your leaves off your stalks your coriander you just want to finally shred it and then you just want to bring it back into a big bunch you just want to give it one more final shred so you've got a nice handful to sprinkle over your bang bang cauliflower at the end just like that then you're going to get a little bowl you're going to place it all in just like that so once you have done all your prep for your sauce you just want to now cut your limes so you're just cutting them down the middle just like that so you will need two limes one for your sauce and one to squeeze over the top of your cauliflower so just like that and then you carefully squeeze them when you need them so now you want to make your little bit of a batter for your cauliflower I have first started adding some corn flour into my mixing bowl now you're going to get your salt and pepper and you're just going to season your corn flour and you do the same with a bit of ground black pepper to season our corn flour then you get a fork you want to give that little bit of a mix in and then what we're going to do in a minute is we're going to place all our cauliflower in with our corn flour and seasoning and then we'll give them a good stir in coat and then we'll fry them now you want to put your cauliflower in with your corn starch and seasoning you have to get your hands in you take a few out just so you can get to the bottom and then you'll place them in you start off with all the ones you've got in the bowl and then with some ones you've got left you can either put them in the bowl or you can add some more to them just carefully place them in using your hands to go get a nice coat give it a little bit of a shake so it all comes off the bottom so they all get coated in do this for a few minutes so next step you want to switch on your hob You want to set it to medium heat just like that you want to get a pan and place it on the ring give that a minute or two before you start frying your onion garlic and ginger you put a little bit of olive oil in your pan so it doesn't stick now you want to start frying your onion garlic and ginger so you get them all out and you just spread them out into a nice thin layer so it starts to sizzle 
and you start to smell all your flavours kicking in. So we're just going to fry this to make our bang bang sauce. So you're just sweating down your onion, garlic and ginger. And then you add in all your sauces to give it flavour. And then we'll put this on the simmer and then we'll fry our cauliflower. To make our bang bang cauliflower today. But first you're just frying your onion, garlic and ginger. As you can see this is what it looks like at the moment. So we're just finishing off frying our onion, garlic and ginger. Then we're adding our hot sauce, sweet chilli and syrup. And my sister recommended me to make this bang bang cauliflower. But you don't just have to make it with cauliflower. You can make it with chicken or steak. And if you've got any ideas, like my sister said, you can always let me know down in the comments. Now you want to add in your hot sauce, your any hot sauce. You give that a little bit of a stir. And you want to also add in some sweet chilli. Just start off with like that. You've always got some more sweet chilli if you need it. So we're making like a sticky sauce. So we've added in some sweet chilli. And we, I've used Piri Piri, but if you've got any hot sauce, use that. Then in a minute you add in some lamb juice and syrup. Golden syrup. Just to give that little bit of flavour. And so, it, so it's not too sweet, but not too hot. And then you also add in some seasoning, and then you, then you, then we will put it on the back ring on a low simmer. Now you want to add in a good square of golden syrup. Give it one last square. You just give that a little bit of a stir first, and then in a minute we add in our lemon lime juice and salt and pepper to seasoning. We're just adding some golden syrup so we can give that little bit of sweetness but not too sweet so you don't lose all the heatness from our sauce. We just want to balance the flavours and it will give that nice silky sauce. Now you just want to squeeze a bit of lime juice in. See the square thing over, keep your hand over the pan so none of the pips go in. I'll do the same with the other half. Squeeze all the juice out and shake it in. Then you want to stir that in. Give flavour. And then in a minute we will put it on the back ring. And put the lid on. And let that simmer while you, while you fry your cauliflower. So you now want to start frying your cauliflower. I put some oil of oil in. And you just want to put a few in at a time. So you want to get your wooden spoon. And you just want to keep moving them. So they, they go nice and golden. It will take about 5 to 10 minutes. To go nice and golden and cute. So you've got nice colour, nice colour on them. You don't want to overdo the pan.
So we're just going to keep them so they get some colour on them and fry. You're going to add a bit more oil. So now you're going to do your other half, you're going to place them all in carefully. Be careful, there's a nice splash at you. You're going to get your med you're going to get your fish rice and you're just going to give them a little bit of a toss to start cooking them. And then in a minute you're going to place the lid on so they can fry for two to three minutes. And then we're going to drain them so you, so some of the grease comes off them and then we'll place them in our sauce to finish cooking. Now you're going to put the lid on just like that. Let them fry for two to three minutes and then you'll keep an eye on them. Now you want to put your cauliflower pieces in with your sauce and then what you do is you place your lid back on just to finish off cooking them and then what we'll do when the rest of them are done in your pan and before you serve up you'll give them a little stir add in some seasoning and your chilli and coriander to serve. Now you want to place the rest of your cauliflower in with your sauce. Just give them a little bit of stir in. So they coat in. We'll give flavour to the sauce. And then just before you start serving up, you'll serve them with some you'll serve this with some rice and vegetables, that's optional. And then you'll sprinkle over your chili and coriander. You want to keep it on a low heat so it doesn't splash. Now you want to add a little bit of seasoning, a little bit of ground salt. Get off your hands. Give that a little bit of a stir in. You want to lower the heat. So it starts to stick to the cauliflower. But you still want a bit of sauce. So they like sticking. And you've got a nice glaze. Just do this for another few minutes so they all cook all the way through. Then you'll pick them off the heat and then serve up with little pieces of chilli and coriander. This is how you make my bang bang cauliflower. Before you, this is how I served it. You sprinkle your coriander chili and lamb juice over so hope you like this don't forget to hit the like button share and subscribe and thank you thanks for watching hit the like button if you like this video don't forget to subscribe more videos coming soon